to allow it to press down on the ice surface, using its weight to crush the ice layer. However, to maintain continuous ice breaking, more fuel is needed to provide power. Once the icebreaker is loaded with oil, the bull becomes too heavy to press on the ice. To address this, engineers modified the bow into an arched shape, ensuring it remains effective regardless of the cargo or fuel load. The bow can still maintain the optimal angle, pressing onto the ice for icebreaking. Traditional icebreakers with diesel propulsion systems can only break ice in rivers and coastal areas and cannot navigate deep into ice fields. To overcome this limitation, engineers introduced fuel rods into the reactor container. When activated, these rods heat water to over 250 degrees. The boiling water enters the heat exchanger, producing steam, which then flows through pipes into the